Hey, sneakers back tonight. Don't know we've got a little Stroomy from Latvia, a Slackware based distro. And we have a little look for you. You can see we've got Terminal, Explorer, Editor, Browser, Firefox, of course. Skype is there. Multimedia, Accessories, Search Services, Network, Desktop, Get Skill, and Quit. And down here, if you put your details in, you'll get a temperature and a time zone where you live, which I haven't done. It's on a USB stick, this one. You've got some games if you left click at the top, there's quite a few there. In development, you get Genie Remaster CD, pretty good. And a virtual PC program that I've not looked into just yet. Else is there, simple recorder. Right, okay, radio stations, videos, and music. If we go to radio stations, as you can see, they're mostly Central Eastern European, so that'd be no good to me, but obviously, you'd be able to add your own. As for prayers music, this would be in your music and video files, so hey, you know what I'm saying? you do. In graphics, GIMP is there for only 108 meg. It's all in there. All there to start with. Auto login, languages. Network manager, system manager, task manager. Blimey, here we go. <laughs> Installed hard disk, not very good. Installed to USB, very good. Midnight car commander is there. I haven't seen that for a long while. Search monkey, PC man as well. Conky and the G slapped a package manager, as it's based on Slackware, by the way. Firefox, as I said before. Skype's there. PW get, I love it, for getting stuff, nice, 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 transmission, X chat, and something I've never even heard of before, but that's why we like Linux, because you learn new things. Abby Word is here, so I'll open it up to see what version we've got. Now, this is not the most current version in the world, but it's got everything you'll basically bloody need in the end, so no big deal. It's 107.9 megabyte download, so that's only going to take you a little while to download, even if you are in Central Europe, okay, if you're on dial-up, it's going to take you a bit longer, but hey you'll be able to get it and run a nice system. Okay, we'll open the browser, and it goes straight to their website, Ostromi Linux. I can't do the accent, sorry guys. I don't mean to do in Latvia, I just can't do it. It's 1.9.3, this is the one we're using now. It's in Russian, English, Italian and Greek and Latvian. But from CD, flash drive or hard disk, etc, etc, etc. Enough said really, what more can I say? Okay, we'll go somewhere else to make sure everything all works in Firefox, because you know sometimes it don't, and it's a bit of a bummer, especially if you use a live CD. We'll go to YouTube. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh, of course, it's the World Cup today, and it's a bit of a bummer, but I don't watch the World Cup, you know what I'm saying? I've had 35 years of pain, so I don't bother watching anymore, because I know what the result's going to be. Anyway, enough of that. Let's find a few video to watch. Just quickly, just to see if it actually works. Okay, I just think I'll spot one just down there if I scroll down. <coughs> Excuse me, but the fact is, is it going to work? Oh yeah, it is. Look, we've got the circles, it's scrolling, and we've got video. Now, considering I'm recording at 30 frames a second here on old dual core, not core 2 duo, by the way, it ain't done too bad, I don't think. So yeah, that's pretty good, isn't it? And as you can see on the top down the CPU monitor, it's a bit of a lag in there from the old flash. You don't like that too much, but you've got to expect that of any distro sometimes, really. You have to expect it, especially if older machines, it's going to hang on to it. Scarps a good inclusion, though. Really nice inclusion. Obviously, you have to agree to all their stuff. Wallpapers. Now, the last Ostromi I used had quite a few more wallpapers than this, and so I thought, I'll just keep this one, because it's quite nice, isn't it? It's quite relaxing, so to say. Resolution. Well, you can have whatever resolution you got. You ain't got to bother doing any drivers or anything. They're all there for you. Here's my resolution. 1280 by 1024, 16 colours, because I made it a screencast, no big deal. But it's really, really nice to use. Now, on the whole, Astronomy is really, really nice, and I like it. Be nice for thin clients and stuff like that, or you just want to just get an old system booted and suited, so to say, sneaky looks out. 